So this spouting is going underneath the property, but then there's this puddling all right here. The brick look good. There's a flower bed there. It is a very good amount of distance from the road and there's trees there and then there's trees on the other side. You can see the road right here and a car is going to come here. You can hear them but it wasn't that they sounded loud. Of course I said that the landscaping needs some TLC. The driveway definitely has some cracking in it. This is that uh, window in the master. Spatting is ending right here at the corner of the garage. No spouting on the garage, which is one thing that baffles me from moving from Ohio. Like, they have a lot of places that don't even have spouting. And then, of course, you see what it does is it puts that little indentation there. Here's the propane gas tank. And we will need to find out if that is leased or owned. Here's the uh, HVAC, which looks very new somewhat. Let's see if it says... Some of that um, covering is going to need to be fixed. And of course, I can't squeeze back there, but you might be able to read that. Okay, here's some more spouting, a little bit of an extension, and it just looks like it ends right there from this corner of the house very very wet for how much rain we just got this area is very wet this looks nice and dry over here possibly there was maybe some foundation fixed there because of the cement changing color and there and there but i'm not 100 percent sure i'm not an expert in that and then these steps just Come outside. Can hear the water going. Whoa, this is very, very wet. I just put my foot into a whole thing of water. Some drainage there. Maybe I'm glad that this has happened while, we, while I was here. So you can kind of see. So there's not that much rain, but it's just entering right there into the thing. So here's the uh, property I'm guessing next door since there's a fence there, but I don't know that for a fact. So I need to get property lines on this. Here's the uh, far side of the house that, I guess it was a family room that was being used as a bedroom. There is some um, flood lamps up there. The spouting here. Looks like it's going underground. My guess is the way this spouting seems to be rigged is that um, that may have been what caused foundation issues. 
see the puddling right there. And I'm back in the front of the house. On the far side of the driveway is definitely tree-lined privacy. And then there's this um, metal building I do not have a key to. And over there on the side, I don't see anything except like woods and stuff. Big utility pole here. And there's down the driveway. Cement right here at the top through the front walk. And then it turns into stone gravel. 